going on guys welcome back to another great day today we're going to be testing out Fantex brand new apex tire inflator now they claim this is the best and fastest mobile tire inflator in the market so we're going to be testing it out today and see how well it actually works and it does come with a couple extra things so they got this uh presto fitting this is for like european style fittings on bikes it does come with this little ball inflator and toy inflator as well and it comes with a little charging cable and then this rubberized fitting that will go onto the actual unit itself and this will attach to your normal straighter valves on tires and regular bikes so that does come with this nice big display on the front here we'll go ahead and turn it on and here we can cycle through some of the settings that it has so we have cars motorcycles bicycles and balls and then you got a manual setting where you can increase the pressure all the way up to 150 psi and we'll turn on the light here has a light and emergency strobe as well the back side it does have a usb c charger and then a usb out to charge phones so pretty nice nice uh tire inflator so far has a rubberized case it does come with this nice carrying case as well see how this works is you turn this on and you pick what you want so we're going to use cars okay? and we're going to adjust up and down so this is the setting that you're going to set it at so if you want 36 psi that's where you put it and then this is what the current psi is on the item that you're about to put on so we're going to set it at 38 we're going to see how long it actually takes to inflate my four broncos 35 inch tires so i'm going to go ahead and take out the schrader valve on the tire and deflate it Go ahead and thread this on and we take this cap off and we're going to go ahead and attach the end of the pump to the vehicle and it just threads on like the cap we got our tire hooked up and our pump hooked up to the tire it's showing it's got three psi in the tire We've got a stopwatch here I'm our pump on all right guys the tire pump still going it's been 10 minutes all right, so we're at 22 psi. It's got a ways to go still, and the battery's about halfway dead. All right, it's been about 17 minutes. Let's go check on the pump, see where it's at. Looks like we're at. All right, so the Fantec pump is still going, as you can hear it in the background. Now, I do want to mention that they do claim that they can air up a basketball up to 50 times on this is on one full charge, or a bicycle 26 times. A motorcycle up to 13 times, a car tire four to six times, and right now I am at still on the first tire, and we're about 18 minutes, and it's still not done. We are at 34 psi. All right, so I actually turned the Fantec off because uh, the battery had died. It got to about 34 psi and it was sitting at 20 minutes and the thing died i mean so it didn't even get to 38 on a full charge to air up the full tire uh then like i said i do claim that this pump can air up a car tire four to six times now it doesn't say exactly what kind of car but i mean 38 psi is not crazy a normal car would take about 30 to 32 psi so 38 it's not crazy i got an f250 there that requires about 75 psi so i don't even think this thing would even get to that point so it's pretty disappointing uh that they claim is saying you know four to six times now there's other videos of people saying that this thing works fantastic now granted yeah if you had a basketball or a car or a bicycle like these it would air it up pretty quick you can get away with airing this maybe bicycle up a lot of times but as far as a vehicle goes uh pretty disappointed in this product because it's not cheap but like i said this is pretty handy for having around the house to air up basketballs bicycles and stuff like that because it is portable and really convenient to have regardless now you can also throw this in the car like if you had an emergency in the side of the road or at your parking lot you can always air up your tire to get to a safe spot to go ahead and fix your repairs but as far as it being the quickest i'm not sure because i do have a compressor here that would definitely uh, air up that tire a lot faster than this obviously not everyone has a compressor in the garage but anyways uh as far as portable units yeah this works pretty great like i said to have around the house i will link this out below if you're still interested in buying this um but yeah guys i definitely wanted to show you guys a video 
on this product because there's other videos out there saying that this thing works great and fantastic. Well, they didn't work great for me, so 